And ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the letter of intent and reception in honor of the 2011 Taiwan Agricultural Trade Goodwill Mission. My name is Heinz Chow. I, I will be the master of ceremony for this afternoon. And we will begin shortly. We'll begin shortly the letter of intent signing ceremony. And uh, I, I saw Senator Tim Johnson just came in. Let's recognize Senator Tim Johnson. <laughs> Senator, would you like to speak a few words for us? Okay. Well, let's uh, first invite the host for today, Ambassador Jason Yuan of the Taipei Economic and Cultural Representative Office to the United States to say a few words for us. Welcome, Ambassador. Uh, Chairman Johnson, uh, Congressman, uh, Dr. Chen, the uh, leader of the delegation and the delegation members, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, my name is Jason Yuan, the Chief Representative of the Republic of China on Taiwan to the United States. <coughs> it's really a great uh, pleasure uh, for me to welcome you all uh, to this letter of intent signing ceremony, and also this reception, and to introduce to you Taiwan's 2011 Agricultural Trade Goodwill Mission. Taiwan and the United States are close partners in many aspects. We share the common values of freedom, democracy, respect for human rights, rule of law, and the free market economy. On top of that, we are ever closer partners in terms of trade, especially in agricultural trade. Taiwan has always been a loyal consumer of American agricultural products for many years. Uh, Taiwan is the, an island with 23 million people. In 2010, we were the sixth largest agricultural export market of the United States. In terms of per capita consumption, we rank number two in the world, second only to Canada. Moreover, Taiwan is the third largest export market for U.S. corn, the fifth largest for U.S. soybean, and the eighth largest for U.S. wheat. I can probably say that Taiwan is the best example of by America. <coughs> Since 1998, my government has been sending agricultural trade missions to the United States to purchase billions of dollars worth of agricultural uh, goods each year. In doing so, <coughs> people on Taiwan can enjoy premium American agricultural goods while creating billions of dollars worth of business opportunities for American farmers. Exporters and affiliate industries. This year, our agricultural trade goodwill mission is led by Dr. Bao Ji Chen, who is an expert and a renowned academic on Taiwan's agriculture. Today, the mission will sign three letters of intent with the U.S. Grants Council. And American Soybean Association and the U.S. Wheat Associates to complete procurement of $5.6 billion worth of soybean, corn, and wheat. After Washington, D.C., the mission will embark on two separate routes. The soybean and corn delegation will travel to Virginia, Ohio, Indiana, Illinois, Wisconsin and Iowa to buy soybean and corn, while the wheat delegation will visit the state of Kansas, Oklahoma, South Dakota, Montana, and Idaho 
to purchase wheat. The signing of this uh, letters is a true statement to an enduring and much appreciated partnership. Procurement mission like this, uh, like th this one, are exemplary of how bilateral trade can be beneficial to U.S.-Taiwan relations and why our government has sought over the years to enhance commerce and to our mutual benefit. These are currently some minor trade disputes between, there are currently some minor trade disputes between our two countries. We hope that this goodwill mission will serve as a, a demonstration of our commitment to satisfactorily resolve our disagreements and to an even closer trade relationship in the future. Allow me to extend my personal appreciation and gratitude to members of the United States Congress for your staunch support for Taiwan in this uh, and too many other ways. Without your active uh, engagement, we would not have the prosperous and the lasting relationship that our two countries enjoy today. I would like to close by noting that while the trade as aspect of this and the past mission is of great importance. They are made in the broader spirit of goodwill, trust, and friendship. That forms the foundation of the U.S.-Taiwan relationship. I'm confident that our two peoples will continue working together in this same spirit to strengthen our friendship in the future. Thank you very much.